Well, hello everyone and welcome back here to Plants vs Zombies. Uh, we've got a motley crew ahead of us this, this time. We've got some cone heads, we've got these really annoying uh, digger zombies, bucket heads, and jack-in-the-box zombies which run up and blow up everything in their path. Those are really annoying. So let's have a quick look. Um, wrong one. Let's have a look at the shop. Let's see if there's anything here that's going to help us. Like now, I'm crazy. Mm. No, I think we're still going to save up 20,000 for nine slots, though. Oh, that is so tempting. These things attack everything, everywhere. And act like a great upgrade. They're a little bit expensive, but they're entirely worth it. Do you know what? Let's buy them. There we go. Okay, so that gives us a, a new cattail. Uh, we think, well, let's include that one in today. So we'll have the sun shroom, we'll have the puff shroom. We'll keep the uh, split pea with us because we still don't have a magnet to deal with the metal zooms. So we'll put the cattail in because it's just so much fun. Uh, walnut for defense. Um, let's take the planter so we can get rid of the, the, the fog and for our final two we'll take the doom shroom and what else should we take mm, let's take squash see how we do let's rock Are you sure you want to play this without any water plants? Ooh, 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 I've done city here, I've done a city here. Uh, what should we leave behind? Right, let's leave behind the Doom Shroom and we'll take the lily pad instead. There we go. Right. Let's start getting stuff out. First zombie will come down here and get whacked by the uh, rake, so we don't have to worry about that. Let's just get our usual trick of getting mushrooms and sunlight out. The zombies, the zombies are coming. Are coming. <laughs> okay, so... We'll get a couple of rows of these guys and then we'll put some uh, planter ends in front of them to uh, push the fog back. That way we've got a decent idea of what's going on. Where are you coming? Where are you coming? Where are you coming from? Brains. Yes, I know what you fought after, but... There we go. Right, let's get a second one down there. Ah, brilliant. Okay. And I'll take care of him in short order. There we go. And we've almost got all of the mushrooms that we need, so... Let's start off with one of those. There we go. Right. And let's defend it quickly. And that's our last mushroom. There we go, he survived. I'll tell you what, let's chuck one of those in front. Okay, that's not good. Let's just stick squash to deal with him. Right, that's our basic defenses out. Excellent, and now we can see a little bit further down the board, which is just going to be good for us. Okay. So, let's defend him. Brains. We'll have a squash by the time he gets over. I'm not particularly worried about him just yet. As I was saying. Right, there we go. Okay. I can't remember if these cattails will actually sit on the water or if I need to put down a lily pad. I think I might have to put down a lily pad. We'll see. 
In the meantime, let's get some upgrades going here, like that. We're coming up to a large wave, so I need to start putting some defences down next. I think we're going to be alright. So, chuck you there. And then we need to get up to 100 and, uh, 225 quickly. Which, as these guys are starting to grow, won't be actually be that hard. 70... 85... 210, there we go. And he... Yes, we need to put him on those. And he's just going to shoot all the time. If anything, so, any time something appears, he will shoot at it. So that's a great addition for us. Chuck you there. And let's get another one up here. Hopefully before that horde turns up. There we go. Coping with that quite nicely. I think he'll actually take both of those out before they get anywhere. But one more bit of sunlight. There we go. And I've got enough to put another cattail down. Oh, uh, that's. Yeah, all of our basic defences sorted out. And stick you there. And come on. There we go. Stick you there. Try to get another row of those down before the next wave turns up. In the meantime. Might as well stick stuff in those slots, shall we? As you can see, every zombie's life is coming a bit painful and short now. Okay, so we'll pop you there. Only real worry about miners now is this row, but the cattails are going to help us now, do Oh, we got it just in time. Excellent. Worried I was gonna have to put a squash down there. Okay, so let's put one of you guys in there. Ooh. Sorry about that, clicked off the screen. There we go. Let's put one of these there. There we go. Right. doing I'd like to do is save up put down another cocktail pop you there it's really one of the most powerful plants in the game to be honest with you there we go got him and let's be honest with you pretty much everything is being prodded in the buttocks now but just to be on the safe side where are you there you are <coughs> I think we didn't need to do that one really. Right. Another walnut here. Ooh, very nice, thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Alright, and we're going to get one more cattail in here. And then what I want to do is start replacing these, these, these shrooms. In fact, let's start doing that anyway. Here we go. He's pretty much, yeah, he didn't last very long at all, did he? Yeah, okay. Right, there we go. I think that's going to be the last one of those we're going to need. Just want to get a few of these now replaced with split peas. It's just going to aid our general firepower. And buttock prodding-ness-ness-ness. Which, let's face it, we aren't doing that bad at this point, I'd say. There we go. Buttocks are being prodded as we speak. Put you there, perhaps? Yes, let's put you there. A little bit more firepower behind that damaged walnut. It won't hurt a bit, I think. One more, and we're pretty much done at this point, which is good because this is the end.
final way. Bye bye. There we go. Oh, what the hell? I mean, it was really needed, but it was fun anyway. <laughs> that miner didn't last very long, did he? There we go. A little bit of extra butter prodding. Yeah, looks like he's the last one. Protects plants that are within its shell. Well, I think we'll, we might give that one a try next time. I don't know. So, until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Zombies. Thank you, and good night.